What is up everybody? Kick06 back with another test video on the Ryzen 7 8700G. Today's game is uh, Rainbow Six Siege, and as always, links for everything are down below, including the link to the AMD Adrenaline software, which you are going to need in order to run this CPU smoothly. Uh, also, if you're curious what is in the build that I'm doing this testing on, a link to every single piece, all the way from the case, uh, the fans, the, the power supply, everything is down below as well. So, for this game, oh, actually, before we hop into that, if you guys want a different game, throw it down in the comments, I will get to it. If it's either cheap, free, or I already own, I have games such as Sea of Thieves, Ark Survival Evolved, Assassin's Creed Val Valhalla, I'm going to do Pow World here coming up soon. Uh, so I got a list, but if you want to add one to it, feel free to put it down in the comments and I will get to it if I am able to. For this test, I can't aim, so I'm not going to do actual gameplay, but lucky for me, Rainbow Six has a setting where you can go through benchmarks. So I'm going to do benchmarks on low, medium, high, ultra, I think there was another one, very high, I think very high is one of them too, so low, medium, high, very high, ultra, and recommended settings, and you're going to see, like right here, uh, there's a final page that shows you kind of your highs and your lows and as you can see the fps on this apu is extraordinary it's really good and i know we're only in medium setting oh i guess that was just low settings but i know we were just in uh low settings but this game is extremely playable and if i had any amount of aim i would i would go in and hop into a lobby with you guys but i did try to go in against bots but for some reason the queue was very long and i was waiting for about 10 minutes and still didn't get in so i just cut that off but so it's going to keep going through all the way to your recommended settings feel free to skip forward if you're hoping to put it into a specific um uh, specific graphics setting um as always you can adjust get more fps or less by adjusting settings no matter what whether you want to be around medium or high or low or ultra you can always tweak the settings to your own liking but yes this game is extremely playable i would definitely recommend it the only one that i uh, actually two there's two games that i would not recommend playing on these one has already been covered and that was starfield and then the second one is actually coming up in the next video and you're going to find out why but anyways that is it for me enjoy the rest of the video if you want to see a different game put it down in the comments my name is kick 6 and i'll catch you on the next one Thank <laughs> you. 